Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Priming. And I am Fezzik Jr. And welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 episode. So if you'll notice, we're doing a, a beard a beard um, uh, intro. So And we, we are um, respectfully dis social distancing of six feet apart. Yes. See? See? So um, the way you can tell is my avatar is three feet, I think. Right? No, 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 no. One by one by one unit is a foot, right? In this uh, world? I, that, that sounds about right, yeah. Yeah, we'll, we'll say that's a foot. And if you look, there's about six units in between two of us, so we've got some good social distancing, but that's not why we're here, because we're here to like forget about COVID-19 and the, and the virus, and forget that we're um, all stuck in our house, and have some fun inside Lumber Tycoon 2! Yes! <laughs> So, Fezzik <laughs> has recorded something um, about the new logic, and I'm, I'm not quite sure what it is. It looks like a clock. I think it's a timer of some type. Yeah, right? yeah. So. It's, it's kind of like the uh, the sprinkler timer that, that people have on their, their uh, electrical outlets. Or the Christmas light timer. <gasps> yeah. We could have our Christmas lights on at nighttime. Yes, yes. Um, let's see, where is oh, the best um, place for all your sorry. logic? Probably go, go to the back. left of the, the axe shop. And I'll okay. open up the, the back wall for us. Cool. Boink. So this right here. No. Boop. There you go. Come on in. This is my logic shop. <laughs> 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 and see this right here? This is actually where I was, um measuring out how many units each one of these is is like big and recreating it in uh, in studio so I knew exact units of measurement nice are these all for me these aren't all mine right yeah you have them. I've got I, I don't do a lot of logic stuff on this place base so I've got no other use for them gotcha sweet thank you I'm not whitelisted by the way oh <laughs> <laughs> now I'm just gonna go, go ahead and straight up open one of these up. Turn, yeah. Rotate. Place it directly on the wall. That is a big piece of logic, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's like. It's like it's like. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's like portrait size. Oh, and it's upside down. Hold on. You rascal. Turn, turn, turn. Nope. <laughs> Try again. Turn. Turn. Mm -hmm. No, it's still upside down, isn't it? Turn, turn. <laughs> <laughs> no. Turn, turn. There we go. Okay. So, is that timer actually moving? Oh, yeah. it is. Yeah, so it basically it follows the sun. Click, 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 click. Yeah, so it's about to go dark. And um, what I've noticed so far is, so the black is where the sun is, right? Um, when the black line gets to the middle of the green, then that's where it'll actually fire off. And when it gets to the middle of the red, that's when it'll cut it off. Gotcha. Now how far around can we go? Uh, 23 and a half hours. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Okay, so this has got to go. That's a lot of clickety clicks. That is a lot of clickety clicks. 48 okay. of them. <laughs> oh, oh, dear me. <laughs> <laughs> There, done. <laughs> so, um, let's hook this up right over here. Let's move this. And we can take this, move. I'm going to set it right here. 
That way it's under there. Need another did you, wire? Did you hear me? Under there? Yeah, underwear. <laughs> <laughs> I just made you say underwear. <laughs> Not this wire here. Uh, I've already got it. I'm, I'm actually moving it. Oh, all right. Well, hopefully it's not the same when I moved. Oh, no. <laughs> Here, I'll move this out. Was it was it the one that was over here already? Is it the same? No, one that moved? Okay. no, it was it was one over here on this wall. There we go. No wait, it's uh, it's reversed. Oh dang it! <laughs> okay. Hey, we got some light. I, I, oh, oh no no no! I don't want to destroy. Please, thank you. <laughs> There's that. And I would say we we go a couple extra minutes, you know, because I mean, dawn and yeah. dusk are still pretty dark. I would agree with that. There we go. That's that'd be good. Then we can put in some some uh, Christmas lights for the nighttime. Okay, so this one's already set for. Oh wait, it's already set for night. Yeah. So that doesn't, well, that wouldn't make any sense to actually. Okay. Okay. Well, never mind then. Um. Now, is this a constant touch? Let's do this. Anything that you can press E on, you can wire up. Yes. Including, hold on. I'm sure I can find one somewhere. Finding something on your base is like crazy. <laughs> and I don't want to tell you what it is either because that'll ruin it. <laughs> oh, goodness. You could. You could set pulses. What do you mean? So, like, um, say you wanted something to fire off every 30 seconds. You could essentially... Hold on. Let's take this one down some. Does it, does it like does um hmm. people in the chat <laughs> in the comment section do you see kind of what I'm thinking um if you were to have four of these set up oh my gosh that would totally work hold on if you have um, them all so, phased to each other so yeah you can you can hook it up to the to the buttons right yeah. Um, when a clock fires, even though it's a constant output, it only hits that button one time. Right. Um, so it just hit, it just gives it a quick click and then it's done. Why don't you have that thing that I'm looking for on know. this base? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm not going to be able to set it right there. Okay, fine. Um, actually, we can go, we can go one up and give it a little bit of space. All right, let's move this off. Move right to here. Phase. Wire's too short. Fine. Like that. Um, 
let's see. Turn, turn. Good. Actually, I'm gonna move this down a little bit. And then this oh, wait, is I know what to do. A three phase system. Alright, those should be yours by now. Alright, so I'm gonna reload. Oh, it does keep firing that way. Okay, that's cool. Mm hmm. <laughs> that's pretty cool. You see what I'm saying? Three phase yeah, yeah. system. We still got wires. We got tons of wires. We good. Yeah. See, and these are the things that I'm like, ah, Defortio, you brilliant boy, you. He's such a good boy. <laughs> <laughs> now, do you want it to go to that one? No, nope, we're we're actually okay. So, turn this off. There we go. So now I need to set up the actual system. So let's see. If I were going to go 75%, about 45 degree angle, right about there, yeah, that's good. That means this one, we're going to go all the way around, and around, and around, <laughs> and around, and around, and around, right there's good. been one too many dang it <laughs> yeah, it'll it'll be close we're, we're not going to be perfectionist at this one not at this point in time not when it involves 47 more clicks <laughs> <laughs> true <laughs> there we go come on three phase system By the way, uh, for those of you that are interested in electronics and stuff like that, in electrical work, a three-phase system is usually used for like large businesses and stuff like that. Stuff that involves bigger machinery, such as power tools and such. But technically, it's it's where the voltage goes up, then down, or positive, negative three times during a cycle on three different lines. Normally you just have positive, negative, positive, negative, positive, negative. Well, on a three phase it's positive, 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 negative, 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 and they're all phased. So they're like, right. they're like that on, on the wavelengths. So <laughs> I don't know if I explained that correctly, <laughs> but it's close. Now what is this? Is this, uh, this is a white neon. What is this one? White, 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 white. These are all white. No, oh, no. It's daylight. Ish. <laughs> <laughs> not in here. It's not. That was a horrible idea. I should never do that again. <laughs> I'll turn it up a little bit for you. Oops, wrong one. Um, hello? <laughs> there. Hello? <laughs> right here. This is what I like about the electricity. Nom, nom, nom. <gasps> Wait, did it feed me? <laughs> yes, because oh. you're the owner of this object that activated it. <laughs> oh, that's, co that's too cool. I didn't have a pink one handy. <laughs> I kept looking for it. I was like, ah, oh, I can't find any candy on the space. How is there no candy on the space? <laughs> <laughs> it was right under the stairs too. Well, I, I brought it in and hid it over there. <laughs> I, I, I loaded at, my other base. I looked at it. I'm like, hey, I got candy over here. <laughs> yeah, I just I kind of stuck it over there a minute ago. <laughs> oh goodness! All right, lights are about to go off. Let me fix this timer. 
that really it's not really in the way is it There we go. Whoa! That's right. Hello. <laughs> yeah, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> that is super. You didn't bright. know you could eat candy that way. Uh, I knew that you can. Anything you can press E on, it, you can activate. So. Yeah. Candy. So like somebody could be working on something on their base, and then you could just walk up to a live wire and throw pink candy on it. <laughs> nom nom nom! <laughs> Dang it! Not again. <laughs> I forget who it was that showed me that. I don't remember. I was like, oh, that's awesome. <laughs> This going to work? I don't know if this is going to work. Sure. Oh, throw the switch and see. <laughs> yeah, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. There we go. And then one last one. Last one. Last one. We're going to have a three phase system. And it's going to be awesome. It's going to be great. <laughs> You're going to love it. <laughs> you know who I was trying to impersonate, right? I give you five guesses. <laughs> <laughs> First three aren't right. <laughs> I'm putting together a committee of highly trained lumber experts. Um, we're going to come in and we're going to build a wall. <laughs> 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 okay, 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 fine. <laughs> uh, three phase system in three, two, one. And phase two. Nice. Oh, snap. And phase three. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> nice. Oh, uh. wow. That works pretty good for eyeballing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, nice. So just so you know, I used to try and make, um, oh, what is it? Um, animated neon signs, like, uh, like out in front of my axe shop, right? Right. I used to have uh, an axe, like a, a neon axe up on top here. And it had a three-phase system with logic that just didn't work right because it, it always messed up or whenever it was loading it wouldn't time right. Well, I think as long as those load in first, right, this three-phase mm -hmm. system should stay in sync. Yeah. So you could make neon signs or other amazing projects. Maybe maybe a timer switch of doors that open and close. But uh, that's 20 minutes, uh, 19 minutes. Oh, wow. So, <laughs> yeah, time flies, doesn't it? It does. It does. Anyhow, huge shout out and thank you to Fezzik for lending me uh, the logic so I didn't have to, like, throw some time at it to, to go and do all that. Um, wow, it is super bright in here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'd like zoomed out. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out, like good YouTubers at the end of the videos, but it's really your choice if you want to, unless it's Fezzik, and he demands that you go subscribe right now. That link's going to be in the description down below. Love you guys very much. <laughs> Sorry, I lied. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Demanding. <laughs> so, um, any last words that you want to say to the fans? You absolutely must hit that button. <laughs> Any last words, Fezzik Jr.? <laughs> oh, by the way, stay tuned for the Lumber Battle build um, coming out soon. Uh, I don't have a link for it yet, but we'll, we'll keep you posted. Uh, follow Twitters. Follow both of our Twitters. We, we tweet a lot um, yeah. for, for a bunch of old men who were born back in the 90s. My um, 90s. 
80s, 80s. We were born in the 80s. Uh, there was somebody on the internet that said, you were born in the 1900s. I'm like, yeah. 1999 would have been the 1900s. It still doesn't. Yeah. They're like, you're old. I'm like, really? <laughs> but if you think about it, if somebody was born in, in 2000, they're 20 years old now. Yeah. That does make me feel old. Love you guys very much. Have a great night, and we'll talk to you very soon. Outro. Outro.